Yes. Watu wengi tumekuwa tukilia, tukisema Mungu ametuacha. Wengine tunasema Mungu amebariki watu wengine na ameacha wengine. Lakini nimekuja kukuambia ya kwamba Mungu wetu sio ubaguzi. Mungu wetu habagui, wapendwa, ni wewe kuchukua hatua. Wakati ambapo Mungu amekuwezesha umelala umeamuka ukiwa mzima, tafadhali rauka enda kazi. Kama hauna kazi, tafadhali rauka enda tafuta kazi. Wengi hatutaki kutafuta kazi, wengi hatutaki kuchoka, wengi hatutaki kuondoka katika zile sehemu ambazo tuko, tumekaa tu ya kwamba Mungu alete mahali pale, wapendwa hiyo haiwezekani. Hiyo haitawezekana na hakuna siku ambayo itafanyika. My friend you have to take action. Ni wewe kuchukua hatua. Katika ile mafanikio ambayo unahitaji, wale watu ambao ya kwamba you compare with your, uh, uh, yourself with them. Utapata ya kwamba yule mtu inafika saa kumi huyu mtu ameamuka na wewe unaamuka saa mbili, saa nne. Then how will you be the same? How will you the be the same? Na baadaye unalaumu ya kwamba Mungu amekuachilia na ni wewe mwenyewe because Mungu hakuna siku ambayo atabeba kazi akuletea hapo kwa nyumba yako. Ya kwamba kila ambacho Mungu anafanya anakulinda, anakupa uhai, anakupa uzima, then anakuamsha asubuhi. Kuondoka kutafuta kazi ni hatua yako. So tafadhali watu tuache mchezo. Na kila ambacho nimegundua watu wengi ya kwamba they want to sleep wakiamuka miujiza ikuwe imefanyika wakuwa wamekuwa matajiri wakuwa wako na gari maisha ni hatua from one step to another hata mwanamke akishika ujauzito ya kwamba hashiki leo na anaza jioni hapana we have a process that should go on lazima yule mtoto ile fota igro kwa tumbo ya mama pole pole mwezi wa kwanza wa pili wa tatu wa ine, wa tano wa sita wa saba, wa nane, wa tisa ndio mama jifungue lakini wengi wanataka tu eh, eh, tuseme kwa mfano ameajiriwa mahali ameanza hiyo kazi kesho amenunua gari kesho ametajirika amenunua nyumba i want to tell you that haiwezekani na ndiposa wengi tunaingiwa na tamaa ndiposa wengi tunafanya mambo machafu tunaua tunaiba tunakuwa na wivu kwa wenzetu pale kazini because tunataka baraka za haraka so tafadhali katika maisha be patient mali pale Mungu amekuweka tia bidii ukizidi kumuomba ili ya kwamba with the time with the time wakati unaendelea kutia bidii naye Bwana anazidi kukuinua unainuliwa from one step to another from one glory to another hakuna siku utashoot tu at hapana and the journey of a hundred a thousand mile starts with one mile so usidharau hiyo mwanzo wako mdogo hapo mahali ulipo wewe endelea kujituma let us tuache ulaziness wanaume tuache kukaanga kwa tv unaochi tu unaamka asubuhi uko kwa tv unaamka kwa asubuhi umeenda kucheza simbi umeamka asubuhi umeenda mshana that is nonsense hata wewe mama ambao unanitazama You will not grow if you just depend on your husband. Yule mtu ambaye ana depend kwa mtu ni kama mtumwa kwa yule mtu you become a slave. So without this person ya kwamba you feel that utahangaika lakini kama wewe ni mtu wa kujituma kama wewe ni mtu ya kwamba unaenda kazini wewe ni mama unapata pesa zako una Unapata unaheshimika your husband will respect you lakini wengi tumepata shida because we really really 100% depend on our husband I hope hii maneno inakuingia wewe mama unayenitazama wewe msichana ambao haujaolewa and you are, you are expecting to get married soon Please tafuta kitu ufanye. Mwanaume atakuheshimu ukiwa na kazi yako. Mwanaume atakuheshimu wakati ambapo you don't depend on this person. Na hata katika ndoa mkitaka kufanikiwa vizuri, ni vyema huyu anatokea huku, huyu anatokea huku. You bring together your resources, utapata ya kwamba mnakuwa. Kwa hivyo ile mambo ambayo watu nimesikia mtu unalaumu Mungu O oh, Mungu anajanibariki sijui Mungu amebariki mandugu zangu na mimi bado Mungu hata beba kazi ya kuletea kwa nyumba Mungu hata kuja hapo ushago umekatalia ushago hautaki hata kuteka hatua uende mjini utafuta kazi Mungu hata leta kazi mahali pale
ni wewe kuchukua hatua and unajua wakati ambapo Mungu alimwambia Ibrahim ondoka haikuwa lazima ilikuwa Abraham ku take action wewe mwenyewe aamue niondoke ama nisiondoke so you see that when Abraham alichukua action hatua akaondoka na ndiposa bwana akamuinua akambariki so tafadhali wewe ambao unanitazama wacha tuchukue hatua tafuta kazi upate wakati umetafuta kazi because god says that he will bless the work of our hands kazi ya mikono yetu mungu ataibariki so the moment unaondoka kwenda kutafuta kazi unapata ile kazi then tell god bless the work of my hand because god says that he will bless the work of our, our hand Eh? unapofungua biashara ambia Mungu nimefungua biashara sio mimi nitaleta wateja ni wewe I, I 100% depend on you nimechukua action ya kufungua so mahali pa wateja ni wewe utaleta then Mungu ataweza kutenda i hope hii ma, mafunzo imekusaidia itakubariki ya kwamba Mungu hataleta kazi hapo kwa, nji, kwa nyumba ni wewe kuchukua hatua kuondoka kwenda kutafuta hiyo kazi shalom shalom be blessed i love you so much remember to subscribe remember to follow me on tiktok wilbafus etuku tv and you will be blessed utabarikiwa mpaka ushangae utabarikiwa maadui zako watabaki kinywa wazi take hii mafunzo itakubariki mm, i love you so much